that's the thing. Let me tell it, you. It actually came in with a lot of people. Like, you were mixed. <laughs> so, was like, it a boys' school only, though? It, it was, was mixed. Like mixed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the shit that gets down in those fucking schools, bro. <laughs> Welcome. Introduce yourselves. Um, my name is Dakbo, and myself and a couple of my friends we run Mob Kinchi. Nice. Dakbo, what is your street name? Uh, <laughs> Dakbo, Dakbo, still. Madu. Madu. Because this guy just called me all for my name is Dakbo. <laughs> I, I thought we were supposed to be for my name. I, I used to like introduce the yourself. Next day I was like, what's your street name? <laughs> <laughs> wow, wow. Okay, well, as you asked, my street name is Fizzle. <laughs> nice. Mm, nice, nice. Um, man like Biz. Yeah, you get it. Man like Peas. Like, man got many Peas. Nobody say I get plenty money, though, but like, I got many Peas popping. All get? right, mm. nice, so, nice. Yeah. So you get like, um, on the other hand, my name is Dolapo, and I. I'm just the guy that you need in your life, basically. Hey, wow. problem solver. <laughs> no. At I one, my boy, one time, he asked me, said, service. from now on, he said, if someone asked me, what do you do for a living? He said, I solve problems. Ah, I'm a problem solver <laughs> on God. Like, <laughs> as a woman, if I heard that, yeah. <laughs> Let me not say too much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, wow. Please tell me, tell okay. me. Please, no, 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 no. This, a, a man, not, we are not holding back. <laughs> We are not old. I think you should. If a man said to me, Yeah, what do you do? I solve problems. All right, calm. Like, <laughs> I'm, I'm with you. Come on, <laughs> are, are, are you making a list? Are you making a list? Or? I said, I'm with you. Like, you know what? Just tell me I'm, I'm here. <laughs> word, word. So, yeah, that's good to hear. Um, well, yeah, thank you for coming to the studio. Mm. So we wanted to talk to you about Mob Kilishi because right now, I mean, I came across the brand last year. I was so impressed by the packaging, by what you're doing. I don't even eat Kilishi. I'm going to be very honest with you. The taste was really nice. So give us a background. Like, how did it start? What inspired you to start the brand? Um, Like, I think it's like a selfish venture, okay. to be honest. Like, I just wanted to have Kilishi around me. Like that was what inspired me to start. Oh. So I just went to Kilishi around me. I would go like the longest to get Kilishi. I would go to like Maryland, Keja Expressway, just trying to like get Kilishi from the road. And I'm like, why should I even do this every time? And the Kilishi was mostly trash. So I was like, like let's street let's, yeah. Kilishi, mm. right? Yeah, so like, I know it's normally like the uh, it's like uh, the Northerners kind of make it on the street. Or? Yeah, they make it, but they they like transport it to the streets. Okay, they like, try to, to the sell streets. it okay. um, like in like on in traffic, okay. on in airports and all this kind of stuff. So I was like, let's we've gone to school, right? Like we can make this stuff better. So nice. So so like I want to know the process here. Like you just. You are, you are eating Kilishi one day and the next day you say you want to go <laughs> you want to go and go for the Kilishi uh, uh, <laughs> like, you know? no not really so like some you know the salad breaks like in uni I was done with uni and I was like I'm leaving uni with a third class nobody will fucking employ me Ooh, so what happened well I guess <laughs> I got carried away okay. life so like I'm like okay and I don't really want to work for anybody like in that sense and I'm not being like proud of that kind of stuff but I just feel like I could give more if okay. I was doing stuff on my own so mm, nice. um so this salad break I'm telling my partner I used to be partner I'm like okay it's, it's from Casino State so oh, wow. I'm like okay can you bring me some Kilishi when you go That's to Casino yeah, State yeah. Did, did, did wait does Kilishi first of all does it originate from the north um I actually uh, originates from in Nigeria yes in the north but it's like uh, it's like a one thousand six hundred year old tradition. So it, oh, wow. it, it's from the um, these guys, the Americans fought to get their land. 
The Indians. The natives. The natives. Native natives. Native Indians. Native Indians. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, how did we now pick it up all the way from there? So, like, you know, you know, know like it, culture. It's mix. just culture now. It's just culture and mix. Yeah. And food. Them is like 1600 years. Here is like 400 years. Mad. Yeah. So like, you know, those guys that do the trans saharan trade, mm. they take, they need, they need food. And that was the way they were preserving yeah. the food. It was just, yeah. it was just, it was, yeah. e- it was the easiest way to preserve food. Mm. And Kinnishi, correct me if I'm wrong. I've always known beef jerky. Is yeah. that the same thing? It's the same thing. Mm-hmm. Same thing. Yeah. The same thing. Okay, so okay. what we call it in Nigeria is kilishi. You call it kilishi. Mm. And I drew. Well, obviously, we had extra spice. Yeah, yeah. Kill- that's exactly. That's exactly. You know. <laughs> <laughs> that's what they call it kilishi. That's killing you with the spice. We're, we're just, we're just, we're just extra spicy here. Extra as well. Okay. So that's the that's the that's the whole story. You know so what? You made it for yourself. Yeah. I was just about to say something, right? Like the first time I had Kilishi, my dad brought it from Sokoto and he was like, This guy, this like this is their suya, this is the way they make these things and they preserve it. Yeah. But the one that he brought was so thin. Yeah. So I want to know like why the size of the, the Kilishi is always changing because one package you get is like thin, some is bigger. Yeah. And some of the some it takes you too longer to chew it. Some is not. Mm. So like, how does that whole process go? Like, you tried it. You tried it. Yeah, I've tried it. So, okay. means, so pretty much, it means he has tried all the all the kilishi, oh, yeah, yeah. the rubber, the rubber. <laughs> <laughs> Like, don't, don't worry, don't Let's worry, don't worry. Explain what the rubber is. That rubber has that rubber has a story. Don't <laughs> worry. Oh, but God. let that let that go say. Let that go say. So, like I said earlier, on, I'm like, if if you've gone to school and you've learned some stuff, like. Mm you know how to make stuff you know how to make stuff better mm. basically so like we didn't start it wasn't that perfect when we started mm. Cheers. we thought it was perfect because it was better than what we had like what was on ground your packaging but, is a1 i know mm. we'll get into the but it's yeah. a1 yeah. so like we didn't start that way like it's like a like it's been a learning curve for us at the end nice. of the day so <laughs> it's like I don't know if I have to give out the sauce. Sorry, but, sorry. I need, I, need, I need to add. He said, I need to add. He said, daily learning curve. Yeah, yeah, every yeah. day you are getting the knock. Yeah. 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 Thank you very much. So you, you get yeah. better every time. Like, <laughs> you, know, you get better every time. Like you try to like use this stuff. You know, it sounded nice. Oh, we're, 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 we're killing two cattle, two cows. You know, it sounds nice when you say that, but at the end of the day, like maybe what you're doing doesn't make sense because mm. you don't even need the entire part of the cattle to make it. Okay, cheap. that's a, such a good point. Okay, mm. so so I don't want you guys to give away your full secret. Yeah. So, <laughs> you know, but how involved are you? So you're talking about you're involved since the killing of the cow. You yeah. see the whole process. Yeah. 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 Okay. The, the thing there is like in in understanding such venture, you need to actually understand the process from the beginning to the end yeah. Mm. Yeah. because yeah. most of the time a lot of like i said earlier i don't know before the show we started the show like i said it's it's knowing what to do basically mm. if you don't if you really don't know it don't worry you can you can continue to be like oh, i'm doing this but it wouldn't actually just amount to anything oh man so like what you are saying that like it's it's uh um, you really have a nice packaging it's so nice <laughs> it's a1 <laughs> babes that's like that's like you're giving us our flowers oh uh, no, but it's it's a1, no you haven't even started giving us our flowers yet <laughs> no but, it's a1, As if, but like no I'm, i understand what you're saying but like when I'll, i i'll take that over 10 million in in, in six months <laughs> but really yeah but really like it's 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 just it's just the it's just the fact that like you're being able to understand the process from beginning mm. to the end so like when i said the rubber mm. i meant because i've actually i'm i'm actually the one on the road usually okay. so yes i i actually get to hear a lot of questions yeah, sorry. a lot of slaps a lot of knocks and over time they'll be like, ah, isn't it that this thing that they were they put on Insta blog that was rubber? People were eating rubber. Yeah. And it was true. <laughs> Wait, so Kelishi was on Insta blog for Yeah, at some point in time, people were producing rub using rubber to actually just produce Kelishi. Jesus. So so, so so no, so that then a lot of people deterred from it. Mm. When yeah. that when that when that shit broke, eat street food. Do you see what I mean? <laughs> I'm trying to deep this whole thing here. Yeah. I'm just getting combobulated in my mind. Yeah, like, I'm thinking, you know so, how are you gonna use rubber to make? No, I really, I really don't understand the the thought process to it. Hmm. But it happened, and people profited from it. However, it is so. I think hunger is a thought process. So, so you hunger. can hunger, like like the people making it, like they're like hungry. 
and they don't care about human lives. You understand? Mm. So, so they just want to make some money. They just want to like, make money. Facts, they you get know, desensitized kind of to human <laughs> lives. You get, yeah, so yeah. It's, 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 to some people, it can actually go the extreme. Some people be like, okay, there's a line. Okay, but explain to me, where did the rubber come into the process? <laughs> no, the rubber coming, <laughs> no, the rubber coming into the process is what was when somebody made a discovery video mm-hmm. and pouring hot water on the kilishi and the pepper Everything just slid drew, off and it was rubber and left. Yeah. It was just rubber. Ah. No, 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 no. Like it was a, it was a, it was a council killer. It was a council killer. I'm not even to see you again now. Even see you as council. No, no, no that but you know, it's no. Trust me, it, it was rubber it, left. It, it, that was then. You know now. Well, with the with the advent of quite some of our some of our competitors, mm-hmm. shout out to our competitors. <laughs> but we know you're not up to. Yeah, the package is definitely. <laughs> no, up but yours. like, it's when people actually eat some kilishi, they be like, oh, okay. Mm. It be like, mm-hmm. but when you actually eat kilishi, you be like, ah, oh. you know. You know, you understand. The people that like so, kilishi really like it to the point that they stock the freezer with it. Mm. Because I've noticed that it's different to other kind of things like puff puff and so yeah, you're like... It's easy eating. It's like, okay, let's say you won't have meat, but you don't want to like have to prep a whole new meal or everything. You understand? Mm. It's, it's just like, like a, you look rich quick for yourself and it's mm. like... A quick meat snack. It's a savory snack. snack. It's not sweet. Yeah. Like You yeah. can just pick from the shop and, and have a good time. So I kind of get the whole point of it. I get why people yeah. like it, right? But for me, yeah. for me, it's like, why is it not in my face? That's the question. Oh, I've not seen this like in my huh. face. What the brand? Not the brand, but Kilishi. Like, why is it not in my face? I've never gone to somewhere and just seen it. I think it's a state dependent. A butcher before you come out the airport. No, you know, the thing there is what face. what yeah. I what I would say is that like, I think one you you are, you are not you're not. I don't think you are adventurous with food. Mm. That's, but the, mm. but also you, that means you're not taking care of other demographics. No, 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 no. Let me just let me just bring out one point. Let me just what I'm just going to say is you're not adventurous with food because if you were to be adventurous with food, you are probably at one point in time I've come across it. No, I've had it. But, I've had but, I'm with, but like, I don't I'm see with, Emma every day right now. Yeah, I would disagree sorry. with him. Okay. okay, you know you said like when you were younger you used to have kilishi like. Yeah. I used to do that. Like my pops used to bring me kilishi when I was younger, and it never used to be enough. Mm. Like it would be like, oh, I've gone for this meeting, I'm coming back, I'm bringing this kilishi. <laughs> yeah. Like it never used to be enough. So like kilishi is scarce. It's yeah, scarce. It's scarce yeah. Yeah. Like oh, it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a scarce. Like you won't see it, but it's something that's supposed to be there. Okay, I want to ask you guys. So, that's so interesting. What's the preservative in it? Because kilishi is something that can be preserved, right? It's preserved yeah. meat. Yes. So, so no preservatives. It no preservatives. So no dry. That. So like what what it is like the, I mean technical aspect might be boring and stuff. But like yeah. basically what you're doing is dehydrating the beef. Dehydrate you're taking it? all the moisture out of the beef. Okay. Not all because mm-hmm. like if you take out all, it's going to just start breaking like crackers. Okay. So like you're taking out maybe seventy percent of the moisture out of the beef. Okay. So that stops the growth of the bacteria, bacteria and all that stuff. And to so finish it off, you have to like roast it. So oh, and what about the nutritional aspect of it? Do you still maintain some of the protein? The- so the drier, the drier, the, the, the drier the, the beef gets, the more protein it has. It has. Oh, okay, good. So it increases the protein. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But then what ah. about other nutrients? Is there any? Yeah, other there's uh, there's other nutrients. There's kind of, um. Yeah. So we use natural ingredients all through. So okay, good. You know, yeah, everything perfect. is from Katsina, natural and organic, basically. You know what okay. I'm thinking here? Yeah. This kilichi stuff is actually it's actually a more healthier food than suya, you know. No, I'm trying to get down suya, but they wrap it in the newspaper. Yeah, and but no, 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 not just, just, not just newspaper. The amount of fat. A, lot, a lot of fats. Mm. A lot of fat in the Because they've already processed to dry that out yeah. already. That is dried, exactly. <laughs> You're so, taking out all the fat. So, like, that's right? why it's, it's, the way it is, yeah. The thing there is, oh. one of the major, the thing there is, um, not everybody has actually keyed into the fact that this particular food mm-hmm. is, or is as this great. Mm. Because mm. you, like you just said, it's more healthier than suya. But shout out to Suya yeah, though. Yeah, exactly. but shout out to Suya though. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you can't, you can't hate on Suya for the reason. No, no, regardless, yeah, but you like you said, it's more healthier than Suya. But on the other hand, you find out that like every time you eat kilishi, 
you still want more. Mm-hmm. But if you eat suya, nah, I'm you not, actually nah, get I'm tired not, of it. That is so I'm true. So, no, 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 I get tired I'm, of I'm just suya. saying. I'm just saying that, like, really? and the main reason, the main reason why, the main reason that, the main reason why that is, is, the main reason why that is, is because it's a lot of fat and oil, and there's a level to what we can actually, our body can actually take it. Oh, sounds like you like that. No, 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 I'm, 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 I'm just being, no and he's way. Still, he, I like how you have a Kinnishu brown, but you still don't. No, no way. way. Because Kinnishu, it's hard for my teeth. Man, I'm just chewing, 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 chewing. It's a chewing. lot of chewing, that's what I was I saying. I can't take the Kinnishu. No, but it's like, when do you get to the point where it's like, it's the fine level of chew? Also <laughs> no, like, that, that, no, that's, also that, that's, that's why, no, that's why, no, that's why, like that's that. why, that's yeah. why, that's why mob Kinnishu yes, is different. I would, mm. yeah. You understand? Like, to have product a lot of people today, would, but, uh, would yeah. actually be, they, trust me, like you go, you would be biting Kilishi and you, you would not end. So, uh, so we actually didn't do intros. That's what I was, about to, so I was about to say. I wanted to do intros because I was going to come on the point about how good you are when it comes to marketing the brand. We want to know your education do, history, yeah, your experience let's take a step history back as well. Yeah. You made a very good point there. Yeah. So, give us your introductions. For- uh, what do you want? To no, so basically, just <laughs> tell you who you are, and then okay. just talk about like your education history, your and experience, your role in your, the brand. and then your role in yeah. the company right uh, now. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's not the role in the brand. You know that uh, role. <laughs> okay, that role. I try to be modest with it all the time because, like, like there's some things that you can do on your own, and like there's a lot of things that you can't really do on your own. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I feel like if I take all the glory, like I'll be taking away from the hard work that my like the other the other people in mm-hmm. on the team mm-hmm. like Putin mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. she gets so like you know everybody would be like oh man you're the CEO blah 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 <laughs> but I like to consider myself the mob boss mob boss yeah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. oh mob yeah. Kilisha mob yeah. boss yeah. these motherfuckers oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I like the sound of that so, so, yeah. Yeah. don't so, yeah. tell a woman that yeah. either <laughs> 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 so yeah so like that's what I, that's what I like consider myself as and like you know like every other person on the team like plays their part so I and you mentioned university before what yeah. did you study at that time so I did economics okay. I studied economics third class as you I guys know already yeah but like I feel like university was kind of like a fake place because they didn't they didn't, they didn't like they didn't really teach you like real life experience like yeah. It was when I got into business that I understood the real life experience. Like everything they taught me in school got clear when I got into business. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, you yeah. know, they could have told me like with an example of what's happening in real life yeah, so than yeah. telling me, oh, I have to do the Y, the X, the this thing every fucking time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just yeah. But so, you know the reason, I mean, just to, to kind of say that, right? The reason why those things are there is because those teachers, they didn't have the, if they really did well in business, they wouldn't be teaching. Yeah. So I actually, when it comes to education, on the mm, side track, exactly. I have a, a different viewpoint. Both are just as important. Education gives you systematic structure to what mm. you're learning, mm. and you need that to approach the practical side. The practical side is also very important to teach. Yeah, you. but when does that come in? That's the question. Yeah. Like, so the mistake they people, make. People yeah. are bringing edu- a lot of education too early yeah, on without too much. experience. Without practical side. Yes. Yeah. So now yeah. you yeah. forget. You be remember, if you're if you're doing practical and you're getting it at the same time. Yeah. You'll be like, oh, this is what I'm learning in the class. So it's like, mm. cool. And now I'm doing it here. It's yeah. making sense. And mm-hmm. you get and you, you get stick. Yeah. You get several eureka moments. Yeah. When you're in the business and you be like, oh, this is this is what they were telling me in class like ten years ago. Like, yeah, 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 I agree with you on that okay. point. No, but continue. So continue. that's how yeah. that's how I feel about it. So I got my economics, BSc, my family, I will lower. Okay. And, you know, I'm out here. I never went back to get my certificate <laughs> 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 because I was like, oh man, like like this is this, this is this skill she or nothing. Oh, so like yes. I'm going all in basically. <laughs> that's good. Amazing. So, and and you. I'll you get to you at some point. But, uh, <laughs> Well, I did human resource, industrial relations, and personal management. In, Ooh, in one degree. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, that's that's one degree in okay. Unilag actually. Unilag, University okay. of Lagos. Mm-hmm. I did my BSc, and um, I just knew that like it was more of me being able to exact my my inner skill in the real life. And that really happened for me when I think that was my 300 level when I actually 
I, I, I interned in a stockbroking firm. Okay. And I, I was able to see life in a different perspective. So it actually even fucked my head to the extent that when I go back to school, because normally we don't intend. And I felt like we should have intend. Mm. It, it should be, it should be something. That's why, like what you said, it felt like there should be more practical real life experience. So let, let me just it. get this right. You don't intern at what stage? Because in the UK, they encourage interns after, in second year of university. So mm. what's the process like in Nigeria? So like, in not, some courses you probably yeah you would have to intern more okay. of engineering courses and stuff like that mm -hmm. but in most business courses yeah they just want you to read it and just get your certificate and get it yeah, for you can't do that in mm -hmm. business courses you, you understand so that's that's the standard for any i can categorically tell you that like i don't think any business department in all the universities in Nigeria, in most, so don't let me say, in most of the universities in Nigeria actually allow their students to intern. Mm. I mean, it's it's just go so read. They, so what, they wait to NYSE or, or, or for, in, for practical experiences? No, like for basically for practical experience. So they actually rely on you to get that practical experience in NYSE. Okay. And it's in, too late. It, it, you understand? Yeah, so yeah. quote and unquote, by the time you are done, you don't really have an understanding of what is really going on out there. So, yeah. 300 level, I was like, shout out to my mom though, like the, <laughs> the, the inquisitive woman, like she just walked up to the MD of Mary Stem that day and like, ah, I, my son wants to intern in your office. So, mm. um, and that was it. Nice. It was more of like, ah, will it happen? Will it happen? Not happen? Nice. And that was it. And luckily I got the job mm. and, I can tell you that that really shaped my understanding to how to go about things, about life, basically. Yeah. So how did yeah. you guys meet, though? Because I'm, I'm yeah. trying to say, so you, you, you went to, I, was, it, was it in one bar, one yeah. street? No like, way. <laughs> how did no that happen? I think it needs to actually just tell the story. No, you know, you know no, you're no, always passing on the story no, to me. Why no, you always pass on the story to For once, I actually would like to hear his own story about it. Uh, so, like, so I was a... I was a maybe like a GS3 student in Mayflower School. Mm. Shout out Mayflower School. One of the best <laughs> schools in the whole world. So I was a GS3 student in Mayflower School. Where was Mayflower School? That's in the Kenya Ogun State. Okay, so nice. it's, oh, it's, wow, I mean, nice. it's made by Tai Shilari and like Shila, Shila, school yeah. is like a prison. <laughs> when you go into it's school, you oh, get like a certain a number. Camp. But but like, like they indoctrinate you into like life. Okay. Do you mm. understand? Like, so mm. like you are like you're missing... 15,000 students. Like okay. you're interacting yeah, with... Yeah, interacting with 15,000. Like a whole community. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. A different community and entirely. Like, like they, they limit what you can do with okay. the time. The outside and the, world and everything. School. So I was a GS3 student in that school and, you know, his mom brought him to the school okay. and she's like, oh, it's my son. And, <laughs> you know, like I was a GS3 student. Like I didn't even have any mouth. I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't know what GS3 is. GS3 is like, um, when you finish primary school, Oh, so it's young. Yeah, so Christ, like three. three years after. Three years after primary you're school. Like when you're, you're, in you're, high school. You're, you're third year in high school. Yeah, you're like, third year in high school. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, exactly. Nine, Basically, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so so you're mom, 14, 15. Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. So his mom is like bringing me to and then she meets me and she's like, oh, this is my son. Like, I want you to look after him, basically. Oh, yeah. she made you like the school buddy. Yeah, like the, and yeah. I was like, I was like a kid. And what, you she didn't get, know her from anywhere. She I didn't know her from anywhere. She's a genius. Yeah. I rate that. So she's like, oh man, this my this my son. You have to like take care of him, man. Yeah, obviously, I had like, like I was a cool kid. I had like school fathers. She so wait, like, how, what's the age gap then? I don't know. I'm 30. 29. You guys look, yeah, you look younger yeah, than your but age. Like, yeah. No, you know, the, then, let me explain it to you. Like, <laughs> the, the school than me. <laughs> called Mayflower is, it's like you said, it's a different society entirely. Mm. So it's, it takes, it takes fortitude. It takes resilience. It mm. takes. To deal yeah. with that kind of. To, you, yeah. you, trust me, like. Is it like, do you have to wear like checkered shirts? Yeah. And stuff? Yeah. You understand what I'm really, trying to yeah. say? Yeah. Like, now shirts. you get it's it. It's a boarding school. There's now hierarchy. you get it. A proper, proper yeah. boarding, yeah. boarding school. There's all that stuff. Like, <laughs> <laughs> proper, like, don't, don't. You don't, know why I'm laughing so hard? Don't mess yeah. around. I went to one of them as well. <laughs> 
So you gotta understand it. So right. I can understand what so, you're talking about I used now. I time with the school fans, boy. I ain't got time for your mask. Catholic <laughs> Hey, do you clear fields? Is it? Do you clear fields? Every day, every what morning? Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. We have plots, man. Every, day, every morning. <laughs> wait, what? In Nigeria, they clear fields for we're, school? We're slim liberals. Yeah, like, <laughs> motherfuckers are in jail. Every morning. Nigeria, <laughs> you look, yeah, in Nigeria the UK, boys, we have it easy. You've heard it here today. You cleared fields. Yeah. Oh, that's manual labor. Nigeria yeah. body squeeze. Like, yeah, we, we did, 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 find it difficult is like when you have to interact with people and like interact with different elements mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so like that school made you interact with a lot of weird people like it was a lot of weird people a lot of <laughs> trust me people. yeah a lot of weird people was, no that's the thing let me tell you it, it actually came in with a lot of people like you were meet <laughs> so was like it a boys school only though it was, it was mixed, mixed. Like yeah <laughs> <laughs> yo the shit that gets down in those fucking schools bro <laughs> The shit that gets down in no, those boys' no, schools, I must bro. be honest. I must be honest. It's gri it's grimy. <laughs> it's it's grimy. No, but but that's what but, people but, are messed but, up. But, but let me let, but let me say something. <laughs> messed up let me, let me say something. Messed up children. Let boy. me say something here. Yeah, like it, it actually made a a proper a, a typical Nigerian child. I must be honest with you. Yeah should actually go through such mm. system at some point in time. Mm. No, 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 I'm a, no, yeah. no, 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 wait, 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 let me land, let me land, let me land, wait, let me land. I my kids there. Yeah. Is it a government school? It was, it used to be a government school, but you messed it up already. So, no, let me not explain something to you. The thing there is, when I say should actually go through such, I meant like, it actually would mold you. No, 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 no. Let me, let me, not all through all the, all the torture we went through mm, because trust me, like we went through shit. <laughs> like we properly went through shit. No, no, I, I can't cap on that. But like, <laughs> you, you, you now see, you, you shaking your head. You be like, you now seeing it as what it is. Obviously, I wouldn't, if I'm actually going to do it all over again or if I could actually make it better, I would definitely make it better. Okay. But like, it would be in the foundation of what I, I believe actually made me what I am right now. Okay, great. Yeah. So I, I, I actually agree with some of the points. You yeah. understand? And you made, yeah. made some yeah. good points. Yeah. Well, what I'm saying is that <laughs> there's some <laughs> traumatized people. Yeah. yeah. That's what, you, said, yeah. you said exactly what I was about no, to say. Yeah, I, it's, no, there's a fine regard, line. Regardless, yeah. regardless of whatever it is. Regardless let me of tell you, whatever. let me just say one punishment that I... I, I, I <laughs> <laughs> well, for this way that I I well, I was I was spectating at the time. I'm not gonna say anything else. This guy, right? So <laughs> there was a senior. So no one in your school, right? In the school, there's different year gaps, and then the, the the one with the largest year gap is the senior, and then you have senior, senior to year, yeah. junior, right? Mm. So the senior that was trying to punish a junior, a junior is like a younger person, and you know what this guy did. What did he do? He told him to go and fetch water, which was 13 miles away. 13. Uh, 1 3. 1 3. He fetched the water and he brought it back. Wait, but the, the junior was so pissed off because he had to walk 13 miles there and back. He was came back drenched, tired, sweating. 13. Wait, 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 wait. So you know what he did? He now peed in the water. Yeah. All right, yeah. And because he, he was so angry, he peed in the water and gave it to the senior mm. that was going to have a shower. Mm -hmm. Now, guess what the senior did? He took that water, he put it there, he put an empty bucket, and he gave the junior a teaspoon. <laughs> to drink it. <laughs> no, no, To fill <laughs> to the, the next bucket. one. <laughs> no way. <laughs> That's dark, man. So, <laughs> this is uh, the kind of schools I'm talking about. Jacket. He's jail for children. No wonder yeah. Nigerian men are so wicked. <laughs> no, no. I'm a, I'm must, I must be honest with you. That's dark, I, 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 See, I must be honest with you. you. A large number, a large, a large number, a large chunk, or it's a large number much. of men from pretty much about 30, 35 to 25 mm -hmm, mm -hmm. actually went through such. Uh, that trauma, yeah. So, be it, even though you're in day school, you would see shit. 
Because you went to many different schools, right? I went to a lot of schools, And in the UK, boy. you went to school in the UK as well. A lot primary of schools school. in the UK. So... <laughs> in both countries. I went to schools in the trenches. I went to schools in the, in the White House, but where else? So I would <laughs> your comparison because... Bullying is 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 universal. Yeah. But this is is this a, ne- a stage up? Is this trauma? Is this so, torture? What do you dis- what would you like articulate it as? So like to describe the Nigerian boarding school like hierarchy of society is like first of all, they told the they told it's like a economy. You put a bunch of people together, yeah. if they form an economy, mm-hmm. right? Mm. So that's the word. They they will there will be that's leaders, the there will be uh, exactly there will be aspirants. <laughs> That's the one. So I can show I you. Did, I show <laughs> the next person out. Oh, I'm am, the guy. I'm yo. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so there's different levels of gangsters and everything oh, going on, man. going on there. That's what right? I'm saying. I'm like <laughs> it, 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 it keeps you, it keeps you awake. Uh, it gives I mean, you real life. It gives you real life scenarios experience. to actually deal with. So I'm, I'm in, in, a, in a camp. In a camp. I, yeah, in I a camp. I agree with mm. all this, I, but I just come. I with what I've experienced in my own life. I always say to you, you know that they always have that saying, "What doesn't kill you makes you stronger." Mm. Mm. I believe there's a balance. Too much trauma can just mess you up completely. That's exactly what I'm so saying. So I think balance. you need so to they, see real that's life. Because like there are there are some some yeah. You people. need to you need to experience real life. You need to experience you know, these things, but you can't. It can't be in excess because what it does. You know, trust me. Yeah. If you want me to say this, yeah, we're all messed up. Yeah, hundred percent. So everybody, yes, you, everybody, yes, everybody yes, they're great. So, yeah. so well, <laughs> no, I, I must be honest. We are all messed up. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, it just get degree. Yeah, hundred percent. You understand? Yeah. So most of the time, I actually see that like you actually feel like there are some people that are like, just waste. They just waste. <laughs> I'm sorry to say, oh, they will just be wastes. But on the other hand. Did they get the day with the day useful? Mm. So, typically, true. like, typically, yeah. tip, no, honestly, yeah. typically, yeah. In, no, growing up, no, mm. having, yeah, having, having, having no, <laughs> yeah, yeah. no, 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 I no, mean, not everybody has that patience because yeah. it, it goes with, it goes, with, I think it goes with the kind of, um, what's it called? The kind of personality we yeah, have. Yeah. The, yeah, exactly. Some people are, some people, what's the word? Some people are, um, uh, what's the word again? Some people can actually accommodate you and actually mm, empathy. Uh, no, 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 not empathy. Like basically, actually entertain the rubbish you would actually have till the day you're going to be useful. Some people can't. Some people would actually just tell you outrightly, straight up. But the yeah, the balance for it, no. To this. be to be <laughs> honest with you, the balance for it is that emotional <laughs> is that emotional intelligence that you get in. You being able to actually accommodate or live with all these worries, exactly. <laughs> you being able to actually mm. live with mad people, it's a different level of in emotional intelligence. It, it, no, I know. I do you see. In fact, this topic is for another day. Okay, it's, we actually never touched on um, Pizzle, your role in Mob Kalishi. Uh, well, that's difficult though, but not really difficult on the other hand. I. I've not been able to define it, honestly. Just as hard, as hard as Dakpo actually just decided to create a safe haven for himself. <laughs> and be like more boss, like mm. he just said more boss, like yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> he just said more boss, yeah, like, like yeah. it boss. was just so easy for him. But actually, like choose your role, man. <laughs> it, you know, you know, you know how you know how hard it is when you actually be like you. You're always trying to intercept in different frequency mm. mm-hmm. because it's 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 part of you already. So it's it's something you live in, you breathe in. However, it is like you wake up, you actually think about it, you actually want to do something about it. So like for me, and really, I'll just say like I I think I'm I, I think I will fall in the strategy and marketing. Yeah, yeah. I know that's what I know you as. You know, yeah, well, I actually just feel in the guy. strategy and marketing angle, though. Because like, where I want to go with this is one thing I've observed of you, you know, for the last many months, you know, since last year and things is your confidence when it comes to marketing this brand is A1. Yeah. So I was at an event somewhere and they were talking about marketing your own content and mm. someone said they removed shame from it. Some mm. of us, yeah. You know, mm. even if you've got something good, mm. we don't have the, the gods to cook yeah, the shame. to blast it everywhere because mm. you know there's an element of shame. Mm. But 
you see this guy right here? He's taught me a few gems over the last year. Mm. Man will bring that packaging to anywhere he is, a social event. He doesn't know who he's meeting, where he's going. And he'll bring the, he'll give, he'll distribute out the killer sheet to everybody. And the packaging, I guess you guys would have seen it by now on, on the video. The packaging is A1. The taste is good. So um, that's why I'm, you know, leading you with these questions. Where did you even get that confidence from? Where did you get the knowledge from to be able to do that? Uh, mm, that's interesting. Well, I... For one, I know that I'm very, I'm a very outgoing person. In as much as I like to be very indoors too, like mm-hmm. I'm very outgoing, and um, I just feel like you actually have to act. You actually have to put out a lot of shit before you actually get that get your flowers. Basically, mm. you actually have to do a lot of work, and um, and this. Is going back to what we were talking about when you say like being trying being being independent of yourself and being confident because I came you yeah, I came I'm I'm coming from a regiment pretty much more or less like a regimented actually angle in my life a young stage whereas I know that like in as much as I know that that right as I'm old as I am I, there's definitely a lot of laxity as to what it was then but like right now I. I know what I want. So like, I know that if I don't do it this way, people are not going to see it. Because I can't actually walk up to people just in normal gathering and just tell them that, yo, come and buy my killer shit. Fuck them. Like, they ain't, they're not, they're not going to actually look at me. So how do you, what's the, what's the distribution line right now? How do you get your killer shit out? Oh, well, we do supermarkets. We yes. do, we do one-on-ones. You can actually just buy off our shop. Our online shop and yeah, um, website. Online shop as well. yeah what's yeah, the website actually... for them to go to? Uh, uh, Mob Kilishi Shop. Mob Kilishi Shop. Shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah but shop. like, <clears throat> excuse me, that's like, like that's not even the major the stuff. The main, yeah. To be honest, like, because like as a producer, you're supposed to be trying to reach out to like a distributor, wholesalers, yeah, and yeah, yeah. Like, so at some point we we're like putting a lot of energy into like trying to like meet individual people, and like that didn't work. Mm-hmm. Because like in the video, people like sometimes they don't rate you. Mm-hmm. Exactly. You get, like yeah. Like it's like when you show them like you're so humble, mm. they take advantage of it. Yeah, that's wow. true. In Nigeria, that's, yeah, wow, that's, that's wow, what wow. it is. So, that's you know that's why I said. Never, that, that's why I said I wouldn't just walk to a gathering and tell yes. them yes, come and buy my yeah, shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I actually, they, they, I actually, they want to see me at my lowest. Yeah. Mm. No, that's in Nigeria. The, it, no, it's not Nigeria. It's the typical it's black, black man. man. No, 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 no. It's human mind. It's a human mind. It's a typical. It's a human mind thing. Yeah, it's human mind. People want to see you at your lowest to be like, oh, okay, actually. I don't mind He's, my lowest. Though. No, because I don't like mind. VC funds like in you, Nigeria, like you they said. don't invest in B to B to C. They only invest in B to B or B to B to C. Yeah. So that's mm-hmm. why I'm yeah. saying it's yeah. an African, maybe not Nigeria Pacific, but it's an African yeah. um, thing in particular. Yeah. They their requirements is that you must be B to B or B to B to C. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You're telling me now that that B to C. Yeah, like, it doesn't know. Yeah, it doesn't like, work. Like so, it, it, yeah. it, it takes a long time. Exactly. Yo, 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 exactly. Yo, yo, exactly. Yeah. Like what you just dropped right now is a fucking huge gem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes a from I tell everybody this. Like, everybody like, that's got a startup, I tell them that. make sure your core business model is B to B or B to B to C. Don't ever expose yourself to the end B to B. You don't have to do that. No, no, that should be the minority of your sales in Africa. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there's Actually, no pride in things that thing. So like, that's why I wanted to ask you. So I'm glad you raised the supermarkets. Right now, I'll tell you what I know and I want you to dispel any myths or confirm what I say. I've heard, yeah, even in supermarkets, whether it's Abuja, whether it's Lagos, you can have your product there and it may even sell. But the supermarket themselves can tell you, oh boy, it didn't sell. <laughs> or they can, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm a, I mean no, yo, so it, let it, me it, just it, be on it, like the supermarkets. Even gets to the extent that like, some supermarket actually give you a three months. We it's actually three, go. Yeah, exactly, we yeah. actually go. That's one time. It's ninety we got days a three, normally. A three months posited check. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, well, hmm. a check is a check though. Hey, well, well, no, 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 no. <laughs> this guy. A check is a check. Go there, we go. Now you're now you're now you're understand. Die. Now you understand what it is. Like, yeah, like now you understand what it is. A check is a check because like. Like we've gone through a lot. Actually, like I'm not even trying to be on some bitching like some bitch ass. <laughs> Honestly, like, I don't even want sympathy. We've been through but like, shit like that. We've gone through a lot <laughs> where like you know we've done a lot of stuff and we felt like oh man we're killing it, but like 
when you look at data and like the uh, the old details, like you know, like you're not killing it. But like mm. now, for the first time, actually, like we're keeping data mm, and good. Yeah. Do you understand? Like, like exactly. we know what it is. Good. So it's mm-hmm. kind of like important. like That's a little bit field. of so arrogance and like yeah. you know confidence. And so like, you're confident about the brand now. Yeah. Nah, that's a, a lot. Man. That's a good feeling, so you know. As an entrepreneur, of, yeah, that's, that's a, a very mistake. good feeling. A lot of it, and it goes, make, it goes, yeah. it goes back to what you, how, what you asked me. Yeah. Like I said, when you said that, wow, how am I confident in going out or walking out to people? Yes. I'm like, all of this, it's, it's just a matter of time because mm. me, I see my product in the stands of the big supermarkets in international or international yeah. control basically out, mm. outside the country at some point in time you made mention of one thing the packaging that's why i i think you guys are export worthy yeah you know really you know like our, introduce them to our me packaging bit. actually like pass it passes customs just because of the way it the way it looks you see? and that's what it, 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 like the any bear, country in the bear, world bear looking at the packaging you see that's what i wanted to tell bear you looking at the packaging yes. like oh yeah. That's all I wanted to say. Go because yeah. it goes. <laughs> people are in the diaspora were accustomed, apart from the ones still living the same Lagos life in the in in diaspora, because some people live like that. Mm. Because some areas in the UK they call mini they call mini Lagos in some areas. Mm. But aside from that, diaspora are used to a higher standard. And mm. even when it comes to EU regulation in terms of importing goods, there's a certain standard when it comes to your processing and things, your packaging, you you're good yeah. on that level. So yeah. I see you as a brand when it comes to Nigerian beef jerky mm. or you know Nigerian kilishi. You're on that level. You're on that already. It's not just us, still. It's, well, okay, it's you a have couple competitors. Of, yeah. yeah, but so, I won't say competitors because <laughs> at the end of the day, like, they never reach. Like no, 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 no. <laughs> In no, no. What like aspect? you're disrespecting them if you say they never no, reach. No, no. Like, I'm I'm I respect. We respect the competitors. Actually, like I like, said, shout out to them. The whole point is to be able to create like a product. Like it's, it's to be able to create like um like to give trust to making meat products. Because competitors are not a bad thing. Competitors create a market. Yeah. So when there's many of you, you have like you have a market for yeah, your goods. Yeah, and it's a good industry. So the consumer then has to choose between, exactly, it's mm, now an industry. Yeah, so you have the industry. demand, so then the consumers then choose amongst yes, you. But you, yes. So it's a benefit sometimes. So you just yeah. have to, like for, for us, we have to work as hard as possible to to like separate ourselves from the, the like our like our supposed competition. Mm. Do you get So our, like our own marketing, like our, like our values is that we're trying to keep our cliche as original as possible. Like if you've had a cliche, like if you eat cliche and you remember what kind of cliche you used to eat way back, that's kind of what that's not even kind of like so that's what like our cliche gives you. Taste yeah, yeah, from what yeah, you have on the street, yeah, but it's not street yeah. food. So we're basically. not we're not yeah we're not trying to like I've had that. I, I yeah. mean I've tasted mm, it. We're not I trying to like, it was like that, yeah. be like oh we're the most mm. modern people and you know like we're trying to like stick to the to the to the past and like understand what it is in the present so, so we can create so something I, different. I've noticed that. So how did you approach the supermarkets though? What happened in that? Well, it's like just meet up with somebody that has like ties to the supermarket. Oh, like you don't have man, to, yeah. yeah. Like so, we try to go to supermarkets. I think for me, yeah, one more thing, I'm sorry for interrupting you, but I wanted to talk about like your NAFTA registration. Yeah. <laughs> so how did you get your NAFTA registration? Mm. Mm. So I think like the, 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 the fuss about like NAFDAQ. just so everybody's aware, yeah. you, you're NAFDAQ registered, right? Yes, yeah. yes, we are. <laughs> no, 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 so because so it's they, important they, so they know that it's not, a, it's not a small business we're talking yes, about. These guys have yes. gone through uh, compliance. No, when they see it, they'll know yeah, that they've gone all through. Already. Yeah. So, like you know, stuff makes people jittery sometimes. Like, like stuff that you like something that you don't know makes you like feel scared sometimes. Yeah. So if you understand like the principles, not like not like it's just like any other agency anywhere in the world. Mm. Huh? If you tell them, yeah, if you tell them what you do, if you tell them how you do it, like there 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 are operating procedures for everything. 
basically. Mm-hmm. That's all now that is asking you there's for. There's operating procedures. Yes. So there's like, no. So we have a term on our podcast. So we yep. call. We have a thing called lubricant. I don't know if you know. Lube. <laughs> the lube. Yeah. The lube. Okay. The lube. <laughs> lube. Actually, the, the three of us. The three of us actually have used that yes. term. Yes. Okay, so you know what the lube is. Mm, okay? The lube is what know. you You should know. Because <laughs> in NAFTAC, I'll be honest with you, no, what I have no, been told about in... NAFTAC is you need heavy lube. <laughs> yes. So no. I'm the only Wait, co- 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 you put them on blast like that. Yo, 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 no, yo, because yo. always is saying that operational standards. Yo, I'm, I'm do you like, know what? Do you, do you know what? <laughs> you know, know what? Like your lube can be like people that you know, right? Okay, yeah, that's true. That is true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your lube can be like having a lot of money. Right. Yeah. Which your, lube, is, your yeah. lube so that naftag lube in particular yeah. <laughs> where are you, where, who are you using the lube with is so, it with the person so that you this know one, this, like, one, this, this is why I understood okay. by the nafdaq process mm-hmm. like nafdaq is not complicated like nafdaq ah, is right. like like they are the easiest people to like work with okay because all they are, all they require from you is tell them how you make your stuff and they will come and gauge you based on how you make your stuff like they don't want you to make believe for them. Like if so you make your stuff they, in there, they yeah. visited where you did they visit any of your Yeah, signs? they did. Uh-uh. They did they, they visited our stuff sure, and then yeah. they do like they emergency do, like, visits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like they pull up on you. They like, just pull up on you anytime. Oh, yo, I don't know. you get gang <laughs> <laughs> shit. Yeah, they pull up, they pull up on you. Gang shit. Like, oh, so are you, really, me, are you really doing this stuff that you are saying? I swear to you. Shake it. So if you keep it original, like even if they pull up on you, like you're still doing what you're okay, doing. Okay, let me know. I had one million naira, two million naira. Yeah. How much pub would you need? Well, I mean, I won't even say it was really about the money. Like I was saying earlier on, I'm like, how much did you spend on that NAFTAC registration? Well, NAFTAC registration was not a lot. We spent like say two fifty k. Two fifty k. How much was the Cut lubricant? That's that that was out. that was all the lubricant because yeah. see at the end of the day you guys got a good deal. No 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 wait 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 exactly wait no 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 you have to relate with human beings. Mm-hmm. Like there are human beings that like they're involved in this process. Mm-hmm. Facts. Like if yeah, I tell you facts. that, oh, I'm making my kilishi from Katsina and in Katsina you can go to my warehouse, to my um, what's it called, my factory and like do a like do you understand? Like look at what my factory is mm-hmm. like in, in, in Katsina. Mm-hmm. And there's another people in Katsina that will go and inspect your factory. They know that's what you're doing. Mm-hmm. But I'm telling you, I'm bringing this stuff to Lagos State and this is like I'm I'm making it from the north, I'm distributing it in the south. Mm. So in the south, what you're coming to look for for as Navdak is that oh, where are these guys packing this stuff? Like, mm. is it is it is it safe. is it safe for yeah. people to like use the product? Is it like okay, so, they don't pull up to the warehouse yeah. in the north. So they, no, they'll pull up to the warehouse in the north and they coordinate with the guys in the south. Yeah. Wow, yes. do you understand? Yeah, sure. Like they look at what's in the north. Mm. Mm-hmm. Like oh, are these guys actually like? You know, are they really? Are they, are they what they say they are mm. in the north? I, I mean, that's really that's that's good. So it's yeah. not like it's not like oh, you have to just give somebody a million naira and be like oh, shut up, no, like your navdak is this thing. Not, not, We yeah. got our navdak, you know. We got our <laughs> navdak. <laughs> we 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 gave some like we went through the process. We went mm. through the entire process. Of <laughs> but when they were going to like pull up on us, they came in a 20, 2020 elox, and like it was the top bosses that came. So that day they came. It was because it was yeah. in our office yeah, is in VIO. Yeah, so they're like, oh, <laughs> what, 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 are you, what are you guys up to? <laughs> so like they came and like, I don't know if I say it, but we were not, I won't prepared. say we were not prepared, but like it was just our normal work day. Yeah, it was impromptu. You get, like, yeah. like, so it was the, like it was the realest thing ever. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, like they came, they saw where we like, produced they saw how clean it was nice. and then that time we we're planning an exhibition because nice. like our business is we're not we're not dependent on just the kilishi aspect like the kilishi aspects is just like kilishi is just a product that we'll always have every time but mm. we're trying to like you know we're trying to like have interest in sports we're trying to like have interest nice. in charity we're Good. trying to like have interest in, in food arts, in food and, like shige. so like our business is multi-faceted basically Good, yeah. like so it's Pizzo is the guy that like I'm like I won't talk to anybody on the streets. 
Mm-hmm. But Pizzi is the guy that does that. No, he's, as in, Do you understand? He's the guy that will be the outgoing guy. He's There's somebody that, that like, the, if, if, you, yeah. if, if you study the pack, you see like this is art on it. Yes, yeah, art. So yeah. art on yeah. it is like is like a is like a commercial for one of our team members that does artworks. Wow. She so get like he's in Canada now, trying to make his like trying to be better basically. So <laughs> this is an avenue for for you to. Be the best involved. that you can. And you know what you can uh, do? You can yeah. even start doing art collaborations. No, that's what you said. He said this guy yeah. is... So that's what I'm saying. So, it's just yeah. like... Trust me. Like, when, my, when, when our guy comes back now, his price is... Like, yesterday's <laughs> price is... Yesterday's price, price is different, yo! So you get, like, because... <laughs> nice. we've, been begging, <laughs> we've been begging people to, like, just... Just listen to us. Yeah, like, just, just come to have us. Like, hear what we're trying to say. No, and, like, no, I, look at I, us. I hear you on that. But there's one... There's, sorry, uh, there's a burning question that I have, too. Some of the problems that hold brands like you back is logistics and distribution, like you say. And mm. cash. And you now mentioned exactly in cash flow, but, but this this logistics part of it, you've mentioned casino so many times. Yeah. I know there's not really too much storage issues with your with Kalishi, right? You don't need a yeah. cold temperature. Yeah. But how is how has it been distributing things from Casina to Lagos? Uh, it's been like this smoothest. Because oh. like if you have like the Information like information is the most yeah. expensive. You see, that's what diaspora right suffer when they come here. Yeah, we don't have the like, right information. Yeah, yeah. Like information is the most important stuff that you can even ever think of. Because okay, say when we started, like we started in like 2016 and 2016, 2017, 2018, like we were in like a messed up place. Like mm. we're not really making a lot of money, mm. but we just kept through the fact that oh, we know like what we're, what we're making is top quality, mm. and like we're going to get. Like at some point we're going to get this exposure that we really want. So our guy in Katsina was messing up basically. So he's going to buy he's going to buy a castle and he's going to buy a cow, basically, and say, Oh, I bought this big cow, but at the end of the day, like I don't know, we don't we don't know what he makes. So yeah. he could show you like the biggest type of cow and what he's going to make is the smallest. So in twenty nineteen we pulled up on him. <laughs> I love you understand? Like, Pull up on it. You, know, like, you, 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 you flew to yeah, Katsina. Yeah. Nice. Like, he, didn't, he didn't believe it. Yeah. So, you get, like, so we pulled up on him. We're like, okay, this is what it is. We're, we're, we're renting a place. He, he, he told us that we we're renting a place. <laughs> we're not renting a place. So he was trying to like connive with the owner of the place to oh, say, oh, 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 tell them that I'm renting this place. But the man was so gracious. Right? The man was like, see, I'm not going to say I'm doing this when I'm not doing Good. this. So integrity. Yeah. So that's very important. So we had a like the guy told us like we took our L's, we took our losses already, and I'm like, okay, I'll take this loss. If you want to do this with us, this is what you have to do now. Mm. These are the steps that you have to follow, mm. basically. And then the guy was like, he wanted to be in like he didn't accept that he was messing up, basically. Okay. And he was like, oh man, like I want to, like. He got like is this kind of election uh, like election period, so I guess somebody was giving him money, hmm. and then it was like he thought he thought we were going to die basically. So he was like, "Oh, you guys, fuck off!" Like you, you know, you, you guys should fuck off. I'm getting money. Mm. Like he's he's, he's he's looking at the hindsight. Short basically. term. Yeah. She get like, "Oh, I'm getting money now. Like I'm good." So I'm like, "Okay, if you want to do this like this," and he said, "Oh, you guys should fuck off." And I'm like, "Okay, we're going to fuck off." But this is what we're going to do. The man that was renting the place for us, he gave us a lady that she had a degree in food and stuff. Okay. And Katsina is a very patriarchal society. Mm. Like, they don't believe that women as well. Women should run actually anything. run anything. Okay. Man. Yeah. So we have like, like we employed like a, we kicked him out because, I mean, not like, I, not like we kicked him out, but he chose his part. And hmm. I tried my best to tell him that, are you sure this is what you want mm. to do? And it's like, yes, yeah, this is what I want to do. So I'm like, Reach okay, your bed, so, yeah. like our goals don't align. So you have to, you have to like, have to leave. Be, yeah, you have to leave. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? Like I still have goodwill towards him. If he comes back and says, oh, I'm sorry for what I did. Like, you know, I still want to be in this. But you're going to take orders from that lady that we've employed. Now, exactly. Okay. Because yeah. she's somebody that, you know, she does her job. Mm. She does it right. Love and that. like, is empowerment to shout, out to, yeah. shout out to the women no yeah, I love right. that yeah. seriously like, yeah, if, no, if you go to the north it's crazy yeah. Yeah. Not, like in the north they don't believe that I'm sorry I'm sorry to Speak like the realness yeah. it's the truth like though, they don't yeah. believe that women should have a chance yeah. and and, and and it really go boils down to the, all of the women empowerment and stuff yeah, yeah. I, so, must, I'm, I want to say something here most of the women empowerment I see 
the real women empowerment I see is in the South and the West. Yeah. Mm. I don't see it you can't try that. Like, like and it's, and it's it now goes down to like whoever is listening. It goes down to the NGOs. Yeah, like that women empowerment. You guys probably take it to the real battle line. Yeah, because they they have mm. a religious barrier. Yeah, yeah the, the religious barrier yeah, is 50 50 because yeah, some yeah. of us, but the us Yorubas, were half Muslim, half different. Christian. Yeah. So yeah. The, but they have a strong There is like 90 10. Like exactly. They don't wait exactly. so so to the, yeah. the, the women. So they're I want, to, I want yeah. to just ask, ask this question. Yeah, so yeah, everybody's going to look at me later. So, like, before we wrap up this, I want to know, like, what's dating like in Lagos? You can live in Lagos, right? Oh, this guy ever asked. What's dating like in Lagos like? Girls. Yeah, dating like. Wait, is it all this guy? Girls. Girls. What did you say now? What's dating life like in Lagos? They said dating life is expensive now. <laughs> 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 expensive? How? Why? Why is it going to expensive? Because it is expensive. So, but but you must to 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 kind of live in Lagos. You must have. Well, I think that well, you you probably have some something to say. I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> me. me? Me? Why does Dapa have something to say? <laughs> I have seen it all. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> but like, this in Lagos, I don't know, man. I know they did in a while, though. I see. But I've always had, like, girls that, like, you know, like, I just... Yeah, actually, you usually... Yeah, let me, let me because this is kind of crazy speak. in Lagos. Because, like... They always have get where they die for yeah, but just like, 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 this like is me. crazy. You're like me. Yeah. 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 Like, this is we crazy. We haven't found ones we like, but there's yeah. plenty of yeah. ones that are like... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, this thing is, like, in Lagos, is a bit difficult because, like... It's dang. Yeah, like, it's not... It's, it's, <laughs> not, got like, it's dang. not... It's not... It's not genuine. Facts, Basically, yeah. like, for real, like you want yeah. babes that want you to like, like it's I want to go out of my way for a girl, but like you have girls that just like want too much. It's and, like, transactional. Yeah, yeah, like they want to stress you. It's always you. transactional. And, like I like my, I like my peace, and I like my, I like my quiet. To be honest, like I like my peace. Mm-hmm. I don't want anybody to stress me because I have a lot of stuff that's stressing me already. already. Do you believe that since doctors taking us in this direction, <laughs> do you believe that men with money can't save? Faithful to one a Nigerian man with money can't say faithful to one woman. Just be real. Let's be real because huh. um man, I need to wait till I get a lot of money. <laughs> because if I get a lot of money yeah. and I see and I like Yo, and I yeah. see somebody that I really they say like, a man is only as faithful as his No, option. no, like, let me I'm let not me, going to try this, to this thing, yeah. It's more the, stressful trying to like play games than just try to like keep it real. Well, <laughs> Just what are you like, where, uh, where, <laughs> where, where, finish your point. I've got one more question. <laughs> where, the thing there is, like he said, is 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 enormous stress when you are talking to four or five women <laughs> in a day. Sometimes you would call one the same name as the other one. You understand? Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, 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 it's already... It's, it's hard, hard to remember. remember. I don't know about that it's, one. It's, 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 it's hilarious. Yeah, about? but on the, on, the, on the other hand, that's why I said I've I've seen it. I, I feel I've seen it all. Mm. On the other hand, it's... um, You know, when they say Afishi... <laughs> <laughs> He's not Yoruba, so translate, yeah, translate for him. Please. Yeah, he's, you not, know, he's not Yoruba. When they say, wait, let me finish. <laughs> <laughs> because if people say I should talk now, nah, let me talk. <laughs> see where you started. <laughs> see, when they say he's Afishi, Afawafa. Yeah. You put your hand to cause it. You understand? Yeah. It's also, um, what do you call it again? Um... Ojukokoro. Mm-hmm. You get to start translating as you're talking. Selfish. Yes, That's man. selfishness. That you understand? Sense. Like, yeah. trust me, yeah. Like, like it, goes, want it, goes, it goes basically. deep. Trust me, it goes deep. And I also That's want... Your bank. He's basically agreeing with your banker. I, 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 also, I also want you to understand something that like... If you have money, money be spirit on you, no? Low-key. As a man. No, 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 no. As a typical black man anywhere in the world, a typical black man anywhere in the world, because if he has five thousand dollars, yeah, he's definitely going to buy something worth one thousand dollars on himself at that moment. I in love time. what he just said because that's a fundamental weakness Yo, of a black man. No, it's 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 just it. I love if, what if, you said. Much. If no 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 it's not about anything. It's not about anything. Okay. A typical black man anywhere in the world, 
if he has five, if, if he has two k, thousand dollars. What he's saying is real. He the, would the, buy. Yeah. He would buy a wristwatch, probably of eight thousand or one hundred dollars. I mean, eight hundred dollars or one thousand dollars, or a wristwatch or a chain. The, so what is this? What is the kind of LBL the marginal more? propensity to say for yeah. a black man is He's a low. lot lower than for a white man yeah. because black men have societal cultural pressure what kings floss, man what kings stunts. you understand then we also have the cultural underlying of ego you Yoruba understand culture, so some other cultures have inherited from Yoruba tribe but the Yoruba kings, tribe in particular that, has that, an that, ego that, issue yeah. so our marginal propensity to, to marginal save propensity to save is, 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 is lower is low mm -hmm. So, so if the, the last thing, I mean, how we kind of do normally end this. Stuff so is like, wait, let me let me right. now let me now buttress it. So for a man where man we get five k, say you get five k now, say you get five k for Lagos, okay, you are fine. You know, the typical thing there is like you are obviously going to have the possibility of you having about eight female women. Locking around you for you a eight. month. How yeah, I'm saying, I'm saying eight. I'm saying no, no. I'm saying no, no, no. I'm saying eight. Major, major, major. <laughs> the main reason why I'm saying eight. <laughs> no, no. Honestly, <laughs> honestly, Shalewa, I'm saying eight because <laughs> I think it's stressful to have eight babies, man. No, 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 no. You guys, you guys. No, it takes it takes a lot for you to actually have eight females that you're talking to. It's mm. it's it's a long period of. How are you time. dealing with that, doctor? No, it's a long it's a long period of. It's going to be a long. Wait, wait, wait. Just before this, before that, please, 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 please. Let me just shut this down quickly. I don't know what you're talking <laughs> about. <laughs> wait. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Are you, are you, are you telling me that I am talking? I am eating it. Oh, don't worry. I'm just enjoying. Let, so let me protect. Me, we're me, gonna move. We're gonna move on. Last <laughs> question. And I know it's gonna want to wrap up, right? So it's it's sleeping. You have to say one answer each, right? If you were the president of Nigeria, what would you do yes, differently? Just wrap up. Uh, if you what? If you were the president of Nigeria, what would you What's do the differently? First thing you yeah. Ah, think quickly. <sighs> man, it's not just one thing, man. But what was the first thing, thing you would do? Like first thing I would do is like kick out all like first thing i'll do is to reduce the salary of all the senators house of assembly okay, okay. and all those guys because mm. like governance mm. is not just about how much like, so you know that those governors those senators and they, they, the salary yeah, is no it's yeah, not high right and too much no but you know the no, salary is no, not high it's, it's the yeah bonus. it's no, mad the because i would love to go there it's if the i was incentive. the one i would love to go there too. bro it's the it's incentive it's the incentive right it's you know that right it's, too that, much. it's the incentive that is just outrageous yeah yeah, yeah. but no, for but me for me yeah, yeah. Control that no, one. for me for me for me yeah for me yeah Relative. I'm actually in the world yeah, that have we're the highest. We have the highest like, actually in the whole world compared to the GDP. So, like, senators have the highest salary here. Mm. Yeah, actually, so in Nigeria, you have a choice. It's quite, it's quite, you know, it's quite lucrative. No, it's but the, most, yeah. the incentives are just oh, yeah, the allowances. Like, when you read point. the list of the allowances, that what happened? They get and then imagine the lubricant that will come to them as well to put things in place. They get, they get, they have newspaper allowance. Yeah, but that one is stop it. No, that's not fine. I get newspaper every time on my phone. I don't even want it. But I get newspaper on my phone. You don't get so why should somebody be paying for that? Leave the lubricant. Leave the lube. Yeah. The lube is on a personal and personal note. You understand? But the fact is, no, no. Leave, leave the lube. You will come now. Leave, that always be there. That always be there. Yeah. Leave the lube. Leave the lube. You will come now. Leave. That always be. That will always be finessing. Mm. Yes, that yes. will always be globally. finessing globally, Nigeria, globally yeah. in the world yes, yes so leave the lubing you understand <laughs> <laughs> sorry if that sorry if that came out wrong <laughs> no I love the way it came <laughs> leave, leave that alone leave the lubing you understand but but what I'm saying is like the allowances the incentives they're pretty much based on how they want to live a a, a more sophisticated life mm. and unfortunately we have barbaric in africa mm -hmm. we have barbaric the world democracy yeah yeah because yeah. we 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 have been able to substitute ourselves to the far end of marginalization we have all marginalized ourselves mm. properly as in 
on a yag marginalized. You understand? So you can't actually tell me it's the same thing in the in Europe or in America. Yeah, the marginalization is there, but there is a there is a structure that puts everything together. Like at the end of it, you actually feel like the the structure that makes we want to actually go to Europe to learn how to actually do things in a better way is what we are lacking here. Yeah, no, mm. absolute fact. As regards, yeah, any other thing, mm. economy, everything. Trust me, we are good. So, what would you? What would you? If you were the president, oh, what, would what you do? I would do is um. Nobody is collecting monthly salary again. It's uh-huh. wage. Wage? Yeah. Ah. So mm. please, uh, no, I'm, I'm a bit... Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a, no, 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 no. Trust me. It's wage a lot. is weekly or something. Wage, really? wage is weekly. Okay. And wage is propensity, or I would actually say um, directly, how would I say, you can actually... That, okay, yes, directly proportional to what Your the input, work you're doing. Productivity, basically. Exactly. Oh, so per hour, Interesting. Like per hour. You understand? I, I, you know, that's why I said, you know, when I said earlier, I, I did human resource. Yes, interesting. And I, and I said, like, to me, human resource in Nigeria is just shit. Sorry to say, oh, my elderly ones. Is it dear, human capital is shit? Human capital issue, shit. Yeah, quote unquote, yeah, because... Yeah. We have so many people that want to work, but yeah. they don't actually have, can work. The median age is 19. And, yeah. and you now find out like the people that are not even working, they don't even want to work. Yeah, facts. facts they just want facts. to collect the money. Facts, facts, hmm. facts. Oh boy. Hmm. Yeah. So talking why about would, question of money. Well, <laughs> you understand? Yeah, so why would I why wouldn't talk. I want to actually pay someone that's ready to work and do the work? And actually just get the fuck out. But let me just ask you, Mm -hmm. sorry, very quickly. So your solution, fine, fantastic. But some of these people, a subset of them, Mm. the barriers they have is infrastructure, such as light, constant Mm. light, energy, etc. Do you not maybe think that that's a problem to solve before wage? You know, the, the thing there is, for me, I feel the problem is solved. Okay. We are just being sabotaged. Okay. If you say light... About now, why do you like that? But light no day. Light no day. Light no light no day. Yeah, light no day. But light suppose day. Yes. Let's be frank. Exactly. Yeah. You understand what I'm trying to say? It's 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 something that it's something that we shouldn't even be having issues about anymore right now. Mm. Do you understand? So like, I don't, I don't, I don't want right now. You know, the society things that like, you know that like this is this is a problem. This is something you should change. Mm -hmm. If you actually, if I'm actually being president. Like I said, wage. And obviously, by the time you actually tumble or you break that table of wage and salary, mm-hmm. trust me, a whole lot, of, a whole lot of things are going to change. Nah, because, you know, I like that. That's the, because, I, I no, no, that. no, because we, we could go on for the next few no, hours. No, I'm telling you, I think we're going to have you guys on again. We we'll have to have it you was, guys on because of timing, right? Yeah, no. But, bro, I, I, I understand that salary point of view. Yeah. And, and I feel like it actually makes a valid point. Because once you can cop how much they're getting they'll work more and yeah, they'll do better job people that want to actually do the work that we want, want to be work. there yeah yeah like, it makes sense American makes president sense. doesn't even get 100k every month it makes sense it makes sense yeah anyways, yeah the, the salaries are low but you yeah. get like in Nigeria we get like get anyways guys money. make sure you look out for Mob Kilishi okay yeah. Mob Kilishi dot shop yeah. Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. But it actually w- tastes good w- I'm not gonna w- lie w- to you dot Mob Kilishi dot shop, shop. M-O-B. Check them out. Oh, it tastes yeah. good. Wag bye, wag bye, wag okay, bye. next time they're here, we'll do live tasting on the Definitely. show. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Thank you for mm-hmm. listening. Sign out. We do our tasting program sometimes, though. Like, where can they find that? Yeah. I mean, we used to socials. have a location for mm. tasting, but sadly, the land was so, so that, Instagram, like, you know, <laughs> Mob Kilishi. Yeah, Instagram at Mob Kilishi. Everywhere at Mob Kilishi. Okay, perfect. Mob Kilishi, anywhere, everywhere. Signing Mob out, Kilishi. Shalawa and the cut. See you, man. Shout out, Shalawa. Yeah. Shout out, Duck. You yeah. Know? Shout out to everybody. Thank you for having us.